all right guys welcome back to this video um in the last video i retouched the face and then right now we're going to be looking at um um how i can make sure my clothes are smooth because um i don't like what i'm seeing here i don't like the mark of the underwear showing and then just smoothing out some things so um i still have my frequency separation layer from the last video so i didn't change anything so the only thing i'm going to do right now is to i'm going to duplicate this layer all right so i'm going to clip it in now this is one of the advantages of having duplicates of your low frequency the layer you can also have of your high, fre high frequency too so this layer is a layer for um the skin the skin work and then this one is the one for the clothes so maybe i, may, I made a mistake i won't have to delete everything all right so it's very very an easy way to work um a wonderful fantastic way to to, to work out all right so i'm going to use my mixer brush also i'm going to right click to go to my mixer brush and then i'm going to increase the size now one of the things i'm going to do first of all is to zoom zoom um press my z, z key to you know zoom in a bit and then i'm going to circle out and i'm going to drag down all right now as you can see it's not affecting the texture it's just affect, affecting the color the color part of the image so if i had moved now for you to remove this you have to go to the texture for you to rem to, to remove that where well, you can see the color is still there so, so go to the low, low frequency that is that has the color part of your image and then circle over it and move to where you want it to be it's quite easy so this guy right here i'm going to circle out and then move it downwards so that's how i'm going to remove some of the stains on the clothes it's quite easy i i i mean photoshop is um frequency separation rather is um amazing all right so i'm not destroying the texture i'm just um shifting away the colors that i don't like so let's look at the before let's look at the after that's that's fine so um I, i'm seeing some sorry about that all right so let's press my z key to zoom in okay so i have one here so just drag down and there you go all right so now i'm going to use my mixer brush to start um mixing so i'm going to use my mixer brush now i'm going to make sure my weight is um high maybe 25 will be fine okay sorry about that so i'm going to um, select my zoom key so zoom in a bit so i'm going to press b for to activate my mixer brush so i'm, I'm going to start um brushing down as you can see is smoothing out all right so let's let's see what we've done so far so this is the before and this is the after all right so let's um take your time to you see quite easy now still maintain the lines on you know these lines right here don't remove everything so i'm going to or i can reduce my wet you know or um, just talk around play around with the settings to suit your but i'm going to take, take it down to um 15 and let's see what that does all right so let's see reduce the radius of my brush So let's look at the before this is the before and this is the after the result is um amazing so so amazing so we're going to do it for the other um, side and then the result is so so amazing now be careful not to remove those lines this those lines make it um, natural actually you just have to be careful all right zoom zoom it's always good to zoom out so you can see the full length and know whether you're doing it right or wrong. All right. So let's go.
all right so i think i have this where i want to be so um okay we can s we still have some more jobs to do right here so mix a brush and then you clean out now still maintain the the color variations around the edges those parts can be tricky all right so i'm cleaning you can increase the size the um the value of your wet you can either take it up or take it down so make sure you leave some some marks to you know you don't want it to be too um smooth and all, all of that so i'm gonna um come right down here and then i'm going to clean up Alright, so let's look at the before and then let's look at the after. This is this is remarkable. Alright, this is remarkable. It makes a whole lot of difference in um in the image. A whole lot of difference in the image. So I'm I'm gonna leave it at this and then thank you so much guys for watching this video. Uh make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed yet and then give me a thumbs up, like this video. All right, and then leave me a comment in the comment section. I want to hear from you guys and um, what you want me to do next. And then see you guys in the next video where I'll be cleaning out the back background a bit, you know, trying to crop out this um, upper parts and then this hand. I had someone throw the, um, you know, this part of the image so it will look um, all dramatic and all of that. So give me a thumbs up. All right, thank you so much, guys, for watching. God bless. Bye bye.